Hello, my name is Jason Lawler. I'm the executive chef here at Shoal Premium Ales. Uh, we have a location here on 4th Street on Retro Row in Long Beach. We are a gastro pub, which means that we do a little more upscale food in a casual environment. And we are constantly changing our menu to go along with the seasons, as well as to try to be as much farm to table as possible. As executive chef here, I handle all of the day-to-day -day operations from labor to food costs to ordering as well as guest and customer interactions. Originally, I started as a busboy at a steak and seafood restaurant. And after a couple of months, there was a need for somebody in the kitchen. After doing that for a few months, I was able to move into helping the saute station. And from there, I learned the other stations. And from there, they hired somebody to take my spot, and I ended up helping everybody that was busy at the time. I attended the Art Institute of California, which was a great experience where I learned all the hows and whys I was doing things that I had learned at the steakhouse that I had worked at before. So when I got done with school, I was already at five years experience and could already step into a higher level of employment straight out of school. After school, I had worked actually for a lot of my teachers uh, so I was working in a lot of their restaurants. I had moved on to working at Disney, also working at a Texas barbecue restaurant, which was great. But learning new experiences and starting from the bottom to the top, knowing grill cooking, saute, frying. There's only seven different ways of cooking. And if you know those ways, you can cook anything you would like. Typical day or week for me is you start off early and you come in and you look at what you need and you look at what you have, you start to put your orders together, see what you need to prep, get a list going, and get it started. I'm the executive chef, so I'm starting the list for everybody that works for me. So you just start going through and making lists of things you need to order, or things you need to prep, or things you need to get done. And then you go from there and start knocking out those things. Uh, the advice that I would give to somebody coming into this industry is definitely love cooking, love serving people good food. That's the main thing. Um, the money isn't always there, but if you take satisfaction in supplying people with excellent food and a good experience, it's definitely worth all the time that you put in. It's about giving people an experience that they enjoy and have them come back and having regular customers come in and praise you for the work that you do.